Hello, Bio 100. This is Dr. Klein, and I wanted to do a little tutorial for your um, cell study and microscope exploration. Um, and so really quickly, let me get back to where I'm supposed to be. Um, so when you go into the laboratory, you're going to see uh, right here. This is the one we're talking about. OK. All right. And so um, You've got two documents here. Um, if you click on this one, so you're going to want to download this and print it off um, so that you can write on, on it. Um, if you have a, the skills, the technology skills to know how to write on it electronically, you're more than welcome to do that. But um, for the rest of us, you can just print it out and uh, read through the procedures that are on here. So when you click, you're going to read through this. It's just going to tell you that that's what we're going to do. You're going to click on this link, and this link's going to take you to this website on the right, on my right. Um, it's probably on your left on the screen. Anyway, uh, so you've got this microscope lab in here, and um, there's a guide that's uh, going to help you learn about the different parts of the microscope. Um, you can explore uh, some slides, and uh, that's mostly where we're going to go today. So anyway, what you're going to do, the first procedure is mostly stuff to help you get familiar with the microscope. All right, so you're going to go through that. You're not going to really have to write anything down. Um, until you get to the questions below. And then you're going to want to answer these questions. Now note that um, uh, this part right here, there's actually two questions here. On number three, it's going to ask you uh, the magnification abilities of each objective, right? So let's uh, really quickly go in here real fast. And so these are the objectives right here. Uh, we call those objective lenses. Um, and these objective lenses will have some magnifications. But then, so you'll write down one number to answer this first question, and then the second number to uh, the, give the total magnification, because these binoculars up here have a magnification, and then these objective lenses down here have a magnification. So you have to uh, add them together. Actually, you're multiplying them together. So, for example, these are usually... Uh, a magnification of 10, and if you've got a magnification down here of 4, then it's actually 40, so 10 times 40 would be the total. And so you would write down for uh, A, 4 for the small red objective, and then um, what's the total? Well, you have to include these binoculars, so the actual total magnification would be 40. And so you would do that with each of these other objectives as well. And so you're going to answer these questions um, as you go down here through these things. Hopefully you've read through the materials, uh, the guide tips, and uh, you're able to get through them. Uh, there's also, if you need some extra reading to do, there's uh, some information in your textbook on microscopes as well. Then you're going to uh, kind of quiz yourself here by uh, assigning these letters to each uh, the appropriate piece here. So we got the chem wipes right here. That's O. We know that that would go right here. Okay, those are the chem wipes. Um, then you're going to do the second procedure, and this is where you're going to move over to explore. And over here, you're going to find uh, some slides, some sample slides are here. So you're going to see that you're going to have to find an E slide right there. Okay, so there's your E slide. You're going to click on that and it's going to go in here. And so this is what you're looking at when you're going underneath the microscope. And you see that we've got our different objectives over here. There's four of them. There's the 4X. Remember, uh, because you're also looking through these, it's actually 40X. So add a zero to all of these and you'll, you'll understand how much you're looking at. You're going to be able to adjust the focus by messing with these uh, little toggles down under here, okay? And you're going to want to get it looking pretty good, okay? You can adjust the light 
over here. Okay, so that's how you're looking at these. How would you do this in real life with a microscope? Well, the course objective and the fine objective, uh, I'm gonna expand this real quick. All right, so th these knobs down here, the big knob under here is the course objective, uh, course adjuster, and the little one would be the fine adjuster. So we got our slides, our E slide up there. We're messing with it to try and get it in uh, as good focus as we can. We can adjust again our light. I like that one right there. And so, wow, we've got that. All right. All right, so you're, you're gonna go through uh, and look at the slides that they suggest that you do. for, um, And then you're gonna move down here. You're gonna answer a few more questions, okay? And then you're gonna do pr uh, procedure three. Again, uh, very much similar stuff. You're gonna mess with the adjusters uh, to make sure you get things focused. And then at the very end, you're gonna draw some pictures of what you see in these circles. And then uh, you're gonna submit the entire document. You can take pictures of it with your camera. You can scan it if you want. Again, if you are one of those uh, tech savvy people and know how to take a picture, do a clip, you can easily just paste these in to your document if you're super tech savvy. Anyway, I hope that's a helpful tutorial and um, that you have a good time learning about microscopes. Have a wonderful day.